Professor Gennady Markov, General Director of STC Virus and author of many inventions and discoveries, received an international patent for a new a transformer design which he created. His work involves a new law in the field of physics and electrical engineering. He says, in 1831 Faraday discovered electromagnetic induction. Then his ideas were further developed by Maxwell. For more than 160 years following that, no one advanced fundamental electrodynamics by even a single step. Eight years ago, I applied for an international patent, valid in 20 countries, as I had created a transformer, which has already received four Russian patents. My discovery was made despite the laws of the great physicist Faraday who said that magnetic fluxes in a magnetic circuit should be combined separately with the resulting combined flux moving in only one direction. Only then can you have a working transformer. I dare to do the opposite, take a coil with two identical windings and operate them towards each other. This creates equal magnetic fluxes, moving toward each other, which cancel each other out, but do not destroy each other as Faraday and Maxwell claimed. I determined a new law, the principle of superimposition of magnetic fields in ferromagnetic materials. The superimposition, is the addition of magnetic fields. The essence of the law is that the magnetic fields are added, cancel each other, but they are not destroyed. And here the important part is they are not destroyed and that is the key fact on which my law is based. I wrote an article on this subject, which was published in the journal Applied Physics. I demonstrated a transformer at an international exhibition in China, where it caused great interest among scientists and other experts. That transformer had excellent performance and in fact, it can raise or lower the voltage without any need for a secondary winding. My new law allows us, firstly, to create high power transformers where the weight and size per unit of capacity is 20 to 30 times lower than in conventional Faraday transformers. Second, I created a transformer which, despite its large dimensions and power handling capabilities, can operate at frequencies up to several megahertz, at the present time, a conventional transformer operates at frequencies of only 30 to 50 hertz, and if you operate them at 100 hertz or higher, the metal overheats and the transformer breaks down. My transformer can operate safely at frequencies of millions of hertz. Conventional transformers tend to be very bulky because they contain a great deal of iron with the weight of a standard 4 megawatts transformer being 3670 kilograms. My 4 megawatts transformer weighs a total of 370 kilograms. When constructing a new transformer you can use any quality of steel quality and there are virtually no restrictions on the frequency range in which it can operate. Unlike conventional transformers, a new transformer can be transported from a place of manufacture to the point of use quite easily. This new transformer design gives us a huge opportunity to create a new generation of technology. Professor Gennady Markov's transformative work on transformer design challenges centuries-old principles and ushers in a new era of possibilities in the field of physics and electrical engineering. The principle of superimposition of magnetic fields in ferromagnetic materials presents a paradigm shift, enabling the creation of high-power, lightweight transformers with extended frequency ranges. As we embrace this innovative technology, the potential for a new generation of efficient and transportable electrical systems becomes a reality, paving the way for advancements in various technological domains. Professor Markov's transformers stand as a testament to the power of challenging established norms and pushing the boundaries of scientific understanding.
this transformer this transformer is short circuit short circuit